Hey guys, this is Renee, and I'm here for some real talk. You know that girl that you pushed down in the hall today? Do you know that she's getting abused at home? Do you know that little boy that you called lame at lunch? Do you know that every single day after school, he has to work and support his family? Do you know that girl that you called fat? That she's been starving herself for weeks? Do you also know that boy that you called fat or overweight? He is also starving himself, but he has a medical condition that is causing him to be overweight. And you know that boy that you punched in the hallway as you're going to class? He just committed suicide a few minutes ago. We really need to make our children aware of bullying and what it can do. We need to put a stop to it. We need to set the example for our children so they know what the right thing to do is. Have you had that talk with your child? Letting them know how wrong it is to make fun of others? Have you said to them, how would you feel if someone said something bad about you? Would you like that? No, they wouldn't. Nobody would like anybody to say anything bad about them. No, not at all. But it's very important that we lead with the example. Like we have to be the example for our children. They watch us. They see what we do. And if we're mean and nasty to people, guess what? They're going to be mean and nasty to people, to their friends, or to people in school. We can't depend on the school to teach our children about bullying. There's only so much that they can do. And this goes for adults also, because you don't know what another person might be dealing with. And there's no reason in the world to say anything bad to anybody. What happened to everyone, you know, helping others and being nice to each other? Like, what is it going to do to you if you were nice? Is it going to kill you? No, it's not. You know what it's going to do if you're nice and you do a nice gesture every single day? If everybody did a nice gesture every single day, guess what? This world would start to be a better place. We have to start looking out for each other. Instead of hurting each other. And it all starts with you. So what are you going to do about it? Well, the first thing is definitely speak to your children about it and show them how you treat others. It's really simple. It's not that difficult. Trust me. I believe all of you can do the right thing. You know that little boy walking home from school today? The one you said hi to, and the one you asked to walk home with. 
When he got home today, he was going to commit suicide. But because of you saying hello to him and doing a nice gesture, he felt like he mattered. Whereas before, he was alone. He felt like no one cared. He felt like he had no friends. This stuff is real. We have to open up our eyes. There's too many children committing suicide. We have to speak to our children on a daily basis when they come home. We have to make sure that, you know, something's not bothering them. Are you aware that no matter how old your child is, they could be nine, they could be 10, they could be 11, they could be eight. I don't care how old they are. They all have stress just like we do. It might not be adult problems, but it's their problems. And to them, it's big. To an eight year old, that's big problems that they might be dealing with. It might, to us, it might seem like, oh my God, that's not a problem. But to them it is. And we need to listen and teach our children how to deal with different stresses in our life. It starts as a child, it really does. In today's world, these, you know, these children really don't, doesn't even have time to be children. With the type of schoolwork that they get, there's no time for play. So please, if you have children, speak to them today. Let them know how important it is to do the right thing. How important it is to say nice things to people and not be a bully and not say things to make fun of others. And if they see a kid sitting by themselves at lunch, go over to that kid and say hello and be his or her friend. Because just think, what if that was you sitting by yourself at lunch? Wouldn't you want someone like you to come over and say, hi, would you like to, you know, hang out with us over here? Or just be there and be a friend. You don't know who that person is. So why don't you try getting to know them instead of making fun of them? Because you don't know what that per that kid could be dealing with. You might be calling him a loner or a lame or this and that and not realize that just a couple of weeks ago he lost his mother. We need to put a stop to this. So please set the example for your children. And it starts with you. Make sure your child knows how important they are to you and how much you love them. Well, that's the real talk for today. So please share this video so we can all try to make this world a better place. You guys, you have a great rest of the day and I will see you tomorrow. Mwah!